Hello friends! Welcome back to another episode of Metroid Prime. I'm Parker, and today... Um... <laughs> um... We're gonna go get the rest of the artifacts, but um... One thing I have to get out of the way, uh... Is that this is post-commentary. Um... And I guess I'll get into it more in a little bit, but... That just just so you know, this is post commentary. Um, and so we're gonna be headed to Fendrana's Edge to get the. Why am I so bad at games? Uh, no, to get the uh, the artifact there, and then event, and then later we will head to the Phase on Mines to get the final artifact, and also. Uh, in this video, I will be getting, spoiler alert, the, uh, ice, the ice beam missile charge combo, whatever it's called. So, I'll be getting that. Um, but, yeah. Um, so, post-commentary. Why am I, why am I doing post-commentary? Well, as you could probably guess, there is a... A slip up in the audio. Um, somehow, it ended up recording my audio with my laptop's microphone rather than the separate microphone I use to record, which is much better quality. And here's the thing this is the second episode I recorded when I recorded. Like, I recorded this episode and the last episode. Right before it. So... And the audio was fine for that episode, but for some reason, it just decided, you know what? I feel like using using the crappy laptop microphone. Instead. I, I don't... I don't understand. Like... And I, I specifically remember even making a test recording. And it being fine! And it recording from... The, the right microphone. I just... I'm a bit mad, if you couldn't tell. Because uh, <laughs> I was just like, I'm going to edit this video now, and it's going to be fine. And everything's going to be lovely. I'm going to get it done. It's going to be a good video. And then, here comes this garbage. Also, here, I noticed these grapple uh, hooks, grapple beam targets, I guess you could call which is rather suspicious. Why would they be there if you weren't supposed to use them? So, I'm going to use them. After I take, uh, after I take out the Sheikoth, which is a joke now with the plasma beam. Everything's a joke with the plasma beam. Everything. Um, Okay. So, yeah, there's that. that's why this is going to be post-commentary. Which, I'd rather it not be, but, like... I guess, you know, sometimes... Things don't always work out the way you want them to, Susan. Um... Okay. Um... So, I'm just heading through there. Um... <laughs> I suppose I should explain... Uh why I'm going to be going after the, what's it called, the, uh, ice beam charge combo, missile combo, whatever, uh, because I didn't know where it was, also missile expansion, um, I didn't know where it was, and I kept being all like, where is it, because I figured it should, it would be in the ice section, I'm not going to bother reading these, this has nothing to do with the story, it's just like, setting the mood um anyways uh i figured that since it was the ice beam it would be in the ice section because ice but apparently it's not um because i looked everywhere i could not find it 
Oh, okay, I didn't look everywhere. I, I looked everywhere on the map, and I'm like, there's no where on the map it could be. Which is incorrect. There are totally places it probably could have been hidden. Um, especially since that room I just went in wasn't didn't show up on the map. But whatever. Um, long story short, I looked it up. Um... But that's later on in the episode. Right now, we're just going for the uh, artifact in the f f in Fendrana's Edge. So, um, I guess there's really no reason to keep rambling at this point. So I guess I'll just see you when anything interesting happens. Well, here I am at Fendrana's Edge. And, uh... This is not my proudest moment, uh, in this room. Anyways, uh, so I'm just going to read this, Vendrana's Edge. Seek the unseen entrance at its top to find the artifact of spirit. And so at this point, I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna have to climb up here. So that's what I'm gonna do after I take out these guys. I thought it was going to fall off because of that missile. I already forgot every single detail that happens. I'm just going to... Spoiler alert! <laughs> I fall off a lot. Um, this takes way too long. Way too long. Um, because um, I'm sure you've gathered this at uh, this point in the series. Um... I'm not good at this game. <laughs> um, yeah. It's not my, uh, uh most sh shining, grand, crowning achievement. But I, uh... Yeah. I... <laughs> Exhibit A. Um, I for some reason thought that I could grapple onto that from there and make it up there, which, no. And then I immediately already forgot about that first grapple <laughs> and fell in the water. This is great, isn't it? This is, I don't, mm. this is what happens when I edit. I just look at all the mistakes I made and I'm just like, what is wrong with, wait, what, what did I do there? What did I do there? I just fell right back in. I'm like, you know what? Let's go. Hey, yo. Look like I'm going for a swim. Like. <laughs> uh. It's this is basically what just happened. Okay. Um. So now I have to climb all the way up the room, rather than starting halfway up already. Well, probably more like a quarter of the way up. Well, now, I remember. And then, I, I don't know, I don't think anything interesting happens at this point. I think I just make it to the top. <laughs> or at least, close. Um... Also, if you know, I'm not going to spoil this, but if you know where it's located, you already know how many times I'm passing it. <laughs> it's not fun. Um, I figured that, you know, this was a secret at the top. So I figured, oh, maybe it's in here where I got that power bomb expansion, I think it was. Um, but then I'm like, eh. I'm gonna take one quick look and not do anything. <laughs> like, I didn't even use my x-ray visor, my thermal visor, like, I didn't do anything. Now I take out the x-ray visor, which I'm... ...not seeing anything. And so I'm like, okay... Let's head back over here. Maybe this wall is it? No. Maybe that ice is it? No. Hmm. I wonder what I could possibly do. Let's scan. Is there a... 
unbreakable thing. And the only thing I can really scan is that grapple beam, so no. Um, so then I come down here. And like, what, what am I doing? I'm just... I don't even know what I'm looking at at this point. Like, I don't remember. I'm just... I'm just mad at myself because I know where it is now, and I'm so stupid that I can't find it. <laughs> Maybe it's back in here. Maybe this time I'll actually use my visors. Yep, there we go. And I'm like, ooh, what's that? And then I take off the visor, and then I realize that that's just how the floor looks. Um, <laughs> got some things that I've already scanned. Um, give that one a quick little scan again, you know, just in case. Uh, doesn't look like there's anything I can do in here. So then I leave. Again. Isn't this an interesting episode? <laughs> Me going around. <laughs> uh, maybe this is for the better. I have no idea what I was saying. Before. I look at the map, see if there's any, like marking there. <laughs> I go back to the artifacts, read it again. The thing is, I'm, I'm, I'm caught up on the unseen entrance at its top. So I think that, that means it has to be on one of those, one of the highest, one of the two highest platforms. Like the one I'm on and the one across that you need to use the grapple to get to. And I'm like, and I'm like, at its top? Is it like above me? Is there like a secret door above me? And then I grapple onto that and then fall. And then I fall. All the way down. This is lovely. I think you get the picture. I think I'm just gonna... I think I'm just gonna skip. <laughs> I'm gonna skip to when I actually find it. Because you get it. I keep looking around for it. I keep falling. Oh wait, actually I'll keep this in. I go to like, use the x-ray while grappling. And then for some reason, it, it, it dropped me. Like I was holding Z the whole time. And she's like, no sweetie, you don't deserve to hang on to this. <laughs> okay, anyways. I'm just going to cut ahead to when I find it, because you get the picture. Power bomb number one, wasted. I'll let you know why I'm keeping track of these in a little bit. Power bomb number two wasted. I only have one more. Isn't that fun? And then, okay, then I finally decided let's walk around with the x-ray visor. And then, looky here! A door! And then I use up my last power bomb. To, to open the way to this door. To finally get the artifact. Oh my goodness, that took way too long. 11th of 12. And now there's only one more artifact left to get. And at this point, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. Despite having the absolute worst time finding that one. Um, yeah, next, we're going to head to the phase on Mines to find this tunnel of the great poison where the artifact will be um also there are some things to scan in here that I don't care to read because they're all just they're all just fill it they're not filler they're they set a mood they, they set the story like it's context but like it's not important. It's just like, hey, this was used by the space pirates, and they 
And this is what they said when you crashed their freaking <laughs> frigate. Okay, well, now at this point, I'm like, well, I feel bad about leaving Fendrana because I want to know where the heck the ice beam combo is. Like, because we got the super missile. Don't have the ice one. Then we have the wave buster. And the flamethrower. Which... Is neat, I guess. But, like... And I know, I know the, the, um... The ice beam combo isn't required to beat the game. It's just, I would like to know where it is, and I would like to have it. <laughs> I want it. <laughs> I'm greedy. Uh, okay, so I'm looking around here, and then I'm like, wait a minute. These rooms, they didn't show up, and I already have the map. So, it could literally be anywhere. Here. Which is fair. Like, yeah, it could be. But I didn't want to go around searching for it, and I'm really glad I didn't waste my time, because it's not here <laughs> in Vendrana. <laughs> but anyways, eventually, like, real soon, I end up looking it up and finding out that it's actually in the Magmore Caverns, which, I mean, we have to go to anyway, on our way to the Phazon Mines. So... It works out. Although, this is another thing where I'm just like, Ugh. <laughs> because we've passed it many times. So it's kind of unfortunate. Um, also, absolutely decimated. I don't even need to use the plasma beam to, to destroy you. Um, so, I guess I'll see you when we get to Magmore Caverns, I'm thinking, or if I find something else interesting, like a missile expansion, maybe. I don't, I honestly don't remember what I find, if I find anything. So, I'll see you in a little bit. Yes? Oh, I'm looking it up. Okay, I'm like, why is this just here? Like, what am I doing? I'm looking it up. I'm literally at this moment looking up where the ice beam combo is. And I wanted to kind of just have a general location like, is it in Fendrana? Is it in Magmore Caverns? And then I found out that it's in Magmore Caverns, but then it also told me the specific room, which honestly I'm okay with because like, you know, whatever, like, <laughs> you'll see. It's, it's stupid. Um, it's, come on, it's in the, where, come on, come on, you can do it, sweetie, you can, you can do it. You're almost there. The shore tunnel. It's there. Um, so, that's where we're headed, and then we're gonna, we're gonna go from there, this is where we're gonna show up, and we're gonna go to the left. Head to the short tunnel, and then loop back around. Well, not loop, but just turn around and go back to the phase on mines. So that's the game plan, sweeties. So now I'm actually gonna leave for for for. for I'm gonna skip a while now, uh, <laughs> and I'll see you when we get to the short tunnel. Okay, I'm here. <laughs> um. So yeah, I was just going through here. I'm like, wait a minute. This is it. <laughs> so, yeah. So now I'm like, okay, what do I do? And then I notice that the middle section, the window's cracked. So I'm like, oh gosh, let's break it. And then I'm like, scan. Because why would you scan anything in this room? Why? Why would you ever scan anything in this room? <laughs> if you didn't know there was something here. And then I notice I'm out of power bombs. Because I used them all. In Fendrana's edge! So now, I gotta make my way back around here. Destroy some boxes. 
some magmores. Hope there's a freaking power bomb. And there wasn't any in the boxes. Don't see any. There's health from the magmore. So now I gotta take up this try whatever it's called. Jerk. And it gives me a power bomb, thank goodness. So it wasn't that hard to get one, but like it's still stupid that I used them all up. Anyways, now I'm just gonna throw it down. And then it breaks that open. You look around. You don't see anything. There's a floor there. You go and turn around. There it is! Underneath. Like, who puts... Like, why is that even there? Like, logically. Like, who's just like, I'm gonna go outside this little lava field and put this, this little, this little beam upgrade. The ice spreader. Put it, like, right underneath the bridge so no one can find it. <laughs> it's... Some of these things are kind of dumb, <laughs> where they are. But, whatever. So, now let's use it. Yeah, that's, a uh, pretty neat. Um, but now it is time to head back. That's the wrong way, dude. Um, it is time to head back and go to the phase on Mines. To get the last artifact um, and it should be good and fun and fresh so I will see you when I get back to the phase on mines so here we are the phase on mines so now what I need to do is find a tunnel of the Great Poison. Phazon. Um, also, I'm trying to figure out what the heck the Phazon beam is. And, like, I cannot figure it out. Like, what, how do you, how do you do it? What is it? Why can I not? What is happening? And, it's the charge beam. Because it's, because it says you can't use the charge beam anymore when the Phazon beam is active. So I'm like, well, well, how do? Like, I'm literally surrounded by Phazon. I'm charging it up. Okay, guess not. At least I was, and it wasn't doing anything. So, I don't know what you're supposed to do to activate it, what its benefits are, like... And then I kind of get the, 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 the thought that it might be just something for the impact crater, because obviously that place is going to have tons of phase on because that's kind of what brought phase on here to talon four um so i'm assuming it's more so like a okay time to defeat the boss with your phase on beam which i could be wrong i could be able to do it right now and just don't know what i'm doing wrong or like i'm in the wrong section or something either way that's something also there were Metroids here. And so I'm like, oh, okay, hello, Metroid. And then I'm like, wait, that's different. It's a fission Metroid. Metroid with the ability to split into two forms. The, the fission Metroid is a mutant capable of splitting in two. This split endows the new creatures with invulnerability to most weaponry. This effect is unstable, resulting in weakness to a type of weapon fire. The vulnerability appears to be random due to a chaotic, the chaotic nature of phase on mutation. Which basically means you shoot it, it splits, and then they change colors to signify which beam they're weak to. And that beam that they're weak to, and, and you, then you have to fight two Metroids. That one's weak to power beam, and the other one's weak to wave beam. And I, for some reason, keep pointing at it, shooting at it with the plasma beam. And then, and then, my freaking lock-on thing is just like, yes, yes, lock-on to the one that you didn't change the beam to. Also, getting 
hit by a Metroid is scary, and also that was weird, but then I remembered there are invisible platforms here. Um, also, that camera, or whatever security thing, needs to die. And then for some reason the other Metroid just decided to up and leave after I killed the other one, which doesn't usually happen, to my knowledge. Um, so, I got lucky. Anyways, now... What am I doing? Artifact. Okay, yes. I'm gonna read the artifact thing. Invaders mind the depths in their greed. Forge a path through a tunnel of the Great Poison. So, I need to look for a room with tunnel in the name. And I hate <laughs> this map because it's multiple levels. And so, I keep going to the wrong level. I don't want to. Okay, so I, I already passed the phase on mining tunnel, uh, which is, uh, spoiler alert, where we're supposed to go. Um, and so I don't know what I was doing there, but then I noticed the maintenance tunnel. So I'm like, oh, there's a tunnel. Okay, let's go here. And I'm like, well, how do I get there? I get there. What am I doing? Sweetie, what are you doing? What are you what are you looking at? <laughs> okay. Anyways, maintenance though. So. Oh, excuse me. Yawning. Yellow elevator. Which is in this room. So I'm like, okay, that's nice. So let's head to the maintenance tunnel because that's where I'm supposed to go, to my knowledge, at this point. Um, speaking of knowledge, I don't have any actually at this point, because I'm like, where the heck do I get up? Like, this is the first time I've been in this room. Hey, power bomb! And then I, I figure it out. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm supposed to go over there. <laughs> I honestly don't know what goes through my brain sometimes. I really don't. Especially right here. I didn't hold Z to do the spider ball. What is wrong with me? <laughs> oh my goodness. I am so sorry that you have had to put up for almost 30 episodes with my complete incompetence with this game. <laughs> like, I have had some proud moments, yes. But I'm proud of those, those mo th I'm proud in those moments because I'm usually not good. <laughs> and so I accomplish a basic task and I'm like, YES! <laughs> I'm so good at this game! Um, anyways, here we are, in the maintenance tunnel. Um... And there's... There's nothing. Like, there's absolutely nothing. So I'm like, well, is there... Is, what am I doing? And then I go to open the map, just when it's like, Hey! You gotta get the artifacts! I'm like, I have one more! Calm down! And so I'm like, well, there's got to be a different tunnel. So, that's where I be looking. And there it is. Face on mining tunnel. And so I'm like, okay, that has to be it. And so, that's where we're headed. And so I'm like, where do I go? And then I realize that I can literally get there. From the room I was just in. So I didn't even have to climb all the way up in the room. And all the enemies are back! Woohoo! Including the Metroid! This is great. So I'm just heading through here. Um. Looking for. Uh. Looking for the phase on mining tunnel while avoiding Metroids. 
Also, did you see that? I think the door killed the Metroid. Or something. That was- that was so crazy. Anyways, um, I hope you guys like Metroids, because that's what's happening. Um, of course, these are just regular Metroids now. Um... And this one's stuck. And then... Uh, that one gets in the way to save its, like, brother. I'm like, oh my gosh! So sweet! Let's murder both of you. Um... So there's that. Uh... So now... We're going down here. That's a save room. What are you doing, sweetie? <sighs> and now, just gotta go through here. More Metroids, blah, 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 blah. Um. Also, is that the Phazon Beam right there? I think that's the Phazon Beam. Possibly. But then I completely miss anything, so I can't tell. Aren't I great? I'm super good at games. Um, oh, hello. So now it is time to move on some more. Um, and more fission metroids, my favorite. And so this one splits into a plasma beam and an ice beam. And then the ice beam one gets stuck underneath that mushroom. Which I don't know why I'm shooting at it with a plasma beam when it's ice, but, you know, go off. And there it goes. So I got lucky there, too. I don't always get lucky. Just so you know. Um. And here we are in the fungal hall, right before the Phazon Mining Tunnel. And it dark. So, x-ray, and then I'm like, wait, this actually doesn't help me at all. Thermal! But the thing is, you can't tell which Metroid that is. So, also, it kind of got my face. Uh, and then, and then I just randomly find this missile expansion. <laughs> I don't know if the bomb kind of destroyed an area that opened that up, or if that was just there the whole time. But at this point, I'm just like, let's just zoom through this entire section. Because I don't want to deal with these Metroids. And there are regular Metroids here, too. It's it's a whole thing I don't want to deal with. And I keep getting caught in these pits. I'm like, get me out of here. And then I get... Hit by another Metroid. And I'm like, go, 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 go! And here I am in the phase on Mine Tunnel. And like, look, look, it's right there! The artifact! And so I'm like, yeah, let's go get it! And then I realize that it's one of these sections. Which, this is very easy, but also like very tedious because you just have to like blow up all these rocks and it's like what's the point just let me go down there you're just wasting my time like there isn't like any sort of clever puzzle or like hard platforming or anything like it's it's just that but then hey we got the last artifact oh the artifact of newborn the last of 12 And there we go. All of the artifacts in my possession. Finally. Ugh. It's been... It, it took way too long. Way too long. Anyways, now all that's left to do is go plop them into the artifact temple. And go to the impact crater. And so, now I'm just trying to get out of here, basically. Um, so yeah, uh, this is 
Now, something else happens, but, like, as this is happening, I'm, like, doing my outro. Which, as, as happens every now and then, it takes an unreasonably amount of, an unreasonably long amount of time. Um, and here we are. Fungal Hall A. I'm like, ugh, the save point's so far away. And there are Hunter Metroids, Fission Metroids, regular Metroids. This whole room is just not fun. At all. And so, I eventually make, ma stop. Make my way out of the room into this room where there are bamboos and then I fall and look another missile expansion underneath this mushroom <laughs> so I now have 150 max missiles and it's and I'm feeling great about that and I honestly don't care about the bamboos at this point I'm just trying to get to that save point so that's going to be it for this episode. There's actually nothing else interesting that happens. So, yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. So, thank you for watching. If you like this video, give it a like and share it with a friend. And I will see you in the next one. Where, for one, it won't be post-commentary. Because I will make sure that I'm recording with the right microphone. Um, and, more importantly, we'll be headed to the Impact Crater. Also, that looks like a missile expansion. Spoiler alert, I don't get it at all. I just move on because I can't figure out how to get to it. So, yep, that's it. I'm going to leave now.